everyone, it's Bonnie. Happy Friday. Look who is back. <laughs> My friend Letty is in for the Memorial Day weekend because you just did a book signing and presentation. I did. I'm so excited for him. Yay. So we are going to talk about a lot of stuff today. We got, we got, we got a lot of stuff to talk about. But before we get started, look what I bought Letty. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> Lenny needs his own beverage. I Lenny need a needs beverage. His, Lenny needs okay. a beverage okay. because I don't, I don't know what's in that thing. We're gonna be talking. We're gonna be talking about. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys are gonna be excited about this video. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> it's unsweetened, just the way I like it. It is. I know. Perfect. Got, got a little McDonald's tea fix going on uh, there. So no. okay, we're gonna be talking about. Check <laughs> out our t-shirts. Check out our. I designed this t-shirt. If you're brand new to my channel, if you haven't seen it yet. I designed a t-shirt uh, for Pride Month for Lenny's book. Um, you'll notice that Lenny's t-shirt is a little bit more brilliant than mine, <laughs> because guess who doesn't know how to do laundry? <laughs> she knows how to do a lot of things, but she don't, but do, I don't laundry. Know how to do laundry. <laughs> so Lenny has washed his t-shirt in cold water. I washed my t-shirt in boiling hot water um, with a bunch of other stuff. <laughs> But we are very excited about this t-shirt. I'm actually, we're working together. We're going to have some fun. Yeah, today. we're going to have a lot of I fun. am getting <clears throat> Lenny set up with um, being able to sell t-shirts on Etsy because I just learned how. And I'm so <laughs> excited. Oh my gosh. So we're going to talk about that. Uh, we are going to talk about, we're going to smell some candles. I'm excited. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> so as you know, you guys, when I'm on a loan, um, what's, what happened? Get just the camera here, so we're both in here. Um, what happens is when I'm reviewing candles by myself, you only get my opinion. And you know what I like? I like food. <laughs> <laughs> Lenny, um, I think your tastes are going to be a little different than mine. They're probably uh, a little a more little, subtle. A and... little bit more sophisticated. <laughs> oh, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll take that. Sophisticated is good. <laughs> I think Lenny's a little bit more sophisticated <laughs> than, than me. Okay. Uh, so like I said, if you're just joining us, we have known each other for, um, about 30 years now. 30 years? It's been or, a long time. A bit long, yeah. a longer. Yeah. Longer. Yes. Yes. We go back a long way. We've been working together forever. And we are so energized to be working on a new project together, which includes the t-shirt and the reason <laughs> Lenny's in Cleveland for the book signing, which we're going to talk about after we smell some candles. So <clears throat> you guys ready? <laughs> I'm ready. Are <laughs> you ready? Okay. Candle number one. We're going to dig in. Bath and Body Works. This is the. I love this one. Sweet tea and lemonade. Sweet tea and lemonade. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> I, gotta put your I think I better on. put glasses, put glasses on. on. <laughs> oh my God. You look just like Jeff Goldblum. In this <laughs> Who, by the I way, hear that a lot. He's one of my favorite actors. I hear that a lot. I hope I can I get to play him. his brother sometime that in a film. Would be amazing. <laughs> I love Jeff Goldblum. Oh my gosh. Okay. Sweet. Okay, got it. It's, it's, it's hard to read. Sweet tea that and is, lemonade. Does anyone notice the label is terrible? That label's hard to read. It's like okay. a velvet. All I right. know. Okay, you ready? Ooh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> lemonade? Lemonade. Sweet it's tea little, and lemonade. There's a little bit, it's a little bit more like lemon balm. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I get the lemon. tea, but the lemon is like one of those stronger yeah, lemons. There's lemon. a lot of lemon in like there. Like lemon balm, yeah. almost like lemon rind. Yeah, it is. You yeah, know? That's good to know. That's I like this one. That, so, that's, that's good. You like, you like stronger. I like a little stronger. Okay. This is the limited edition collection. Remember this one, you guys? No longer available. You guys know this is my favorite. I love this one. I don't like the I don't like the and and. Rose water and ivy and vanilla bean. They they did this weird thing where they put two ands in there and it drives me crazy. Literary wise, okay. give it a sniff there. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> mm. <laughs> wow, this is it. This is a little bit of a confusing combination. <laughs> <Isn't it? laughs> Should I smell it or eat it? <laughs> That reminds me, years ago, you won't believe what I did. What? My mother had something called rose milk. And <laughs> you drank it. I, I had I thought I saw it in the kitchen. I'm like, what's this? And I tasted it. I was like, oh my god, this it is like milk. milk. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dude, just, I, I think like that's it. what this reminds me. That's funny. Oh my god, that's hilarious. You don't like it? 
I, it's a little confusing it for me. Confusing. It's, 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 it's in between. Vanilla marshmallow, soft mm. rose petals, and rain kissed English ivy. I don't get the rain kissed English ivy. So no, I definitely up. got the okay. vanilla part too. Okay. Uh, next up, uh, we have Under the Sun. You guys know I love this song. Uh, Lenny has no idea what no. it is. <gasps> oh, I do, I do like this one. You know why? It has banana. coconut in it. And yes, it's got coconut. I love it's it. Got banana too. Mm. I love it because it's like a banana wacky wafer. This is definitely or banana laffy taffy. That's definitely one. That I, I like the candy. You know me. I'm like crazy the coconut. On the candy. I, I love coconut. Okay. Uh, next up. Oh, you smelled this one last week. We're gonna. I we're do. gonna. Yeah, this is the summer boardwalk. That was the caramel oh, popcorn yeah, one. Yeah. We're gonna oh, go do this one. Yes, the warm butter uh, popcorn. Actually, I have another one up here. Okay, this is the one I reviewed last night. You guys remember? I just reviewed this one. We're gonna see if Lenny likes this one. Watch the lid; it falls off. It's okay, defective. driftwood waves. Driftwood waves. Oh, yeah, that kind of takes me to. That's got sandal the, on it. The beach house. It's got yeah. It's got a beach house vibe, doesn't it? Yes. Yes. But like, got... but sort of like the shower area outside of the beach house where you're where you're rinsing off your feet. <laughs> <laughs> said it smelled i read one of my comments or somewhere i read somewhere and somebody said it smelled like a las vegas like casino <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh that's funny okay okay we're gonna try a flower cart i like this one even though i don't usually like florals see what you think of that one okay oh this is soft this is gardenia <sighs> i think are you right i think you're right uh you know what? They're very vague. Floral bouquets. It does smell like gardenia. I, 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 you think it's gardenia? He's he I, knows his plants. I think there's gardenia. It's funny because I have um I, I like right it. outside my I house. I like it. It's it's very pleasant. My it's iris fresh. is just bloom. I like things that feel like they open the up my air like yeah. my air passages. Yeah, that's like okay. Fresh. So that's okay. good. Okay, so we got these. Okay, so we're gonna move on to number two. I'm excited. Okay. Uh, we're going to, I'm going to segue one of these because um, I wanted to show you guys something. This is really fun. Lenny has a really funny story about the show. Absolutely fabulous. And I just found this out last night because I didn't even know this. <laughs> I did not even know this. I'm going to split screen us and I'm going to put a screenshot of right here. And Lenny's going to tell a story that relates to his book. Okay. <clears throat> well, uh, years ago, I had made a film about the 75-year-old Ted Burr, who is that young 19-year-old Ted Burr on the cover. Okay. Right well, when we were showing in the New York Independent Film and Video Festival, I made up posters. Here's the poster. <laughs> Letters to Uranus, The Hidden Life of Ted Burr. And... Uh, I plastered these all over telephone poles and um, bulletin boards. Yes, yes. Well, I went to the Gay and Lesbian Center in uh, New York City, downtown Manhattan. Okay. And they have this big bulletin board where there are hundreds, if not a thousand, postcards, name cards, posters. <laughs> well, I just Funny. plastered this on with a tack, you know, and left. So a couple of years later, a friend of mine calls. From yeah, Christine. Christine. Yeah, she calls and, she's, and she says, I just saw your poster on an on a, uh, an episode of Absolutely Fabulous. And this is the I said, you're show. kidding. This is-, <laughs> this is it. So so it's episode four. I mean, yeah, episode, season, season four, four episode, episode seven. seven. Yes. Epi it's called Gay. <laughs> and if you know the show, Eddie and Pat's, Eddie's son is her estranged gay son in New York, and they go to that find him. That was so funny. Yeah, oh and, my gosh. and then they go to a therapist there. Whoopi Goldberg plays the therapist. Yes, yes. And they I, get I her, the episode they, last night. They get her out of the office. <laughs> Because she didn't want to give them any information because, you know, was privacy. so funny. And so they get her out of the office and Pat, there she is rifling through the file cabinet. And I'm looking and I said, Ted's photo is right there. And you know what, what really tickles me? Yes. Is that the, the uh, set dresser had to have picked that and brought yes. that into that office specifically yes. for that it's episode. It's so amazing. So we, we learned something. I was like, A no British way. TV show A British TV goes show. to New York and, and they picked this poster. And they put Ted up. I know. We were just like, no way. <laughs> I love I love Absolutely Fabulous, by the way. I do too, darling. <laughs> Bonnie, darling. <laughs> Although, uh, although uh, my my tea is not uh, over alcoholized. What else do you, What else do you have that's gorgeous? <laughs> is that a word? I always make up words on my channel, Lenny. You don't know that alcohol alcoholized. Alcoholized. 
this is but this is de-alcoholized. It is de-alcoholized. Un- alcoholized. I know. Yeah, okay. you don't even want to know what happened. If I if I started drinking, it, it doesn't. You know me. So this is my segue. This is my segue because this candle is a chocolate banana mudslide. That's how. I, that's why I started. Like, isn't that a good segue? Yes, it is. <clears throat> it was. So this one is frozen banana, chocolate syrup, crushed ice, and a splash of rum. Oh, Pat's would love this. <laughs> You guys know that. <laughs> okay. I I love it, but I would only want it in the evening. Okay. <laughs> because once I have dessert, I can't go back. <laughs> I don't know. There's just something gross about I love I love you know you know me banana, the chocolate, I love any well, rum and candles. Yeah, but, no, I have to say honestly, if it were if it were cold and okay. you have a warm fire, well, that's true. It's I, almost it's almost like bathing it, in hot chocolate. Okay, well, we'll go. But it, we'll go it, with is, that. It, it is a little bit. It's a little bit. Funky. It's a little bit. <clears throat> a little bit funky. Okay. Okay. One of my favorite candles ever. This is like one of my favorite of all time. I don't think Lenny's gonna like this, but you never know. Should I get the name of it? Oh, you know. You know what cola? Can... Oh, I definitely get the cola. <laughs> I wish it would have been cherry cola. What, I know. <laughs> what is my favorite beverage, you guys? The McDonald's Coca Cola. It has to be fountain pop. I, I don't like soda out of the can. I have to have it in a bottle or a fountain. But you guys know I'm I'm a soda fanatic. Honestly, though, yeah. the vanilla doesn't doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'm just too used to cherry cola. <laughs> Well, you're from Pennsylvania. That, I like I like, like the flavor of cherry and cola, <laughs> vanilla and cola. Well, do you guys in because Lenny grew up in Pennsylvania? Do you call it pop or soda in Pennsylvania? They call it pop. Yes, because that's what I grew up in. I, we were talking about this on my channel a lot. I didn't call it soda until I moved to New York. It's in here. I know, and it's funny because you know what? When, <clears throat> Lenny will have to come back in the fall. I don't say pumpkin. I say pumpkin. 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 <laughs> <laughs> it drives my viewers. There's, there's a, so, so, some viewers that are just like, why are you saying pumpkin, Bonnie? It's pumpkin. I'm like, no, it's pumpkin. Yeah. It's, 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 it's a, a regionalism. It's, it's a regionally. It's kind of funny. Okay. You ready for this one? Oh, I love this one. You guys know what this one is. I'm going to show it. Yes. Yes. Okay. This one is good. We'll see if Lenny likes one of my favorite summer candles. I do like this one. Isn't that good? Mm-hmm. Bath and Body Works. Mm-hmm. I am asking is, Bath and this Body is a, Works. This is definitely a summer flavor. That is flavor. one of the most delicious <laughs> sugar cone peach. I don't usually like peach. I hate peach. I'm not a peachy girl. But the sugar cone works. But the sugar cone with that peach, that's like the best peach candle Bath and Body Works has ever done. It gives, like ever. It gives it that little caramely peach. Yeah, it's, it's that sugar so, cone. Yeah, it's like it's almost like it's cooked or something. Okay, what else do we got in here? Oh, this is like, this is my Desert Island scent, you guys. I don't even know if Lenny knows how much I love this one, but he's going to smell it. He better love it. Mm, it's definitely in my, it's, <laughs> it's in my subtle palette. I like it. It's, okay, good. It's, that's the strawberry pound it's in, cake, it's in, it's in, It's in my subtle I'm palette. Like, I'm like, if you don't like strawberry pound cake, I don't know. I don't know if we I can be friends I do anymore. like it. <laughs> I love strawberry pound good. cake. Okay, yeah. okay, we're good. This is, but it's the fresh cream. Yes with it too yes. it's just really nice i like <laughs> I don't, don't, don't need it <laughs> I know. I need a little please bit. don't eat the can okay um i'm really curious to know if letty likes firecracker pop this is like uh, the full-on oh really full-on summer deep? this is no, you gotta smell go. it you gotta smell it wow it's not what i expected really because i'm getting watermelon in there too it's cherry it's, it's like uh, hey there, there could be yeah could be no but i mean there, it, do you smell watermelon I That's got kind of interesting. Well, I got the it's, I got it's that, a lot like, of because, it, because it's not yes, it is. But it's not Full on cherry. But it's not um sweet sweet. No, no. It it's has that like little it's got a off, pop. It has that little off sweet. Mhm. That I fresh. Yeah, I can... yeah it's okay. fresh. Okay. This yes. is last year's version too. I, <laughs> I got to get the new I, one. <laughs> I'm into things I'm into things that really that like, give me like a fresh feeling, like the warm baked stuff. Oh like, yeah. The fresh airy so this actually is not a bath and body works candle but i wanted to bring this out because this is a kringle candle and you know they came out with that um kitchen herb and i just wanted to see what lenny thinks of basil this is kringle though well i love eating basil for sure you gotta try this you gotta try oh yes oh yeah see oh my gosh okay so what you do (laughs) so what you do is you you have this lit while you're cooking yes yes cook an italian meal (laughs) 
with bays, fresh <laughs> By basil the way, not in only the air. Lenny's a better cook than me too. I don't do laundry and I don't cook. <laughs> Lenny's better at laundry. Than I, okay, put a little bit of you put a little bit of music on and a little Italian music, a little fresh basil, <laughs> and you have an evening with Stanley Tucci. <laughs> I love Stanley Tucci. I love Stanley Tucci. Searching Tuchy. for I Stanley Tucci. Oh my gosh. I do too. I much. do love him. <laughs> and Jeff Goldblum. <laughs> so I had to bring that one out. So, okay, we had the candles. Oh, and Coco, you know what's coming? You got there is a truck outside, and you know what is coming. Right, there's, like, we're getting delivery. We're getting a delivery. Okay, we're going to take a three minute break. I got to see what's on that truck because yes. it's going to be good, and we're going to come back. We are back. <laughs> we got the door. We settled the dog down. She's still barking a little bit. Yep. There you yeah. go, Coco. Look what I got in the mail. <laughs> I don't even know what this is. I tore the um the label off. I didn't open it though. Goose Creek just sent me a box and I have no idea what it is. So we're we're just gonna we're gonna, do, we're gonna do a little sneaky peeky. <laughs> okay, what is Oh my oh my gosh. Oh my god oh my gosh, you guys. <gasps> We were just talking about this. I, it's just it's, holy moly, you guys. Um, strawberry cup. These uh, are strawberry cupcakes. These are <gasps> this is a cupcake collection. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, I, I'm going to start with this. Oh one. my gosh. Okay, we got to do. I got to oh. do these in a different video. We're doing a little pre, pre, sneaky peeky okay. preview, but oh my gosh. <gasps> okay. Oh, lemon. Mm. <laughs> oh my gosh okay okay i get it i get it we're gonna i i gotta think about this <gasps> oh my gosh okay that butterscotch one. butterscotch no that's my favorite these are goose creek. <laughs> right, oh <laughs> my gosh goose creek okay i'm gonna i'm gonna settle myself down here we're gonna put these over <laughs> we're gonna Drink put these over no we're okay, good i'll, good. I'll just okay. hold them. give okay. you something to lean on <laughs> so oh my gosh this has been fun this has been like beyond fun and um, one of the reasons, of course, that I brought Lenny on here, not only for the fun, but because if you saw our last video, he has edited a new book. I'm going to show the book. A lot of you uh, were commenting on the book. And um, this is an incredible story. And coming up into Pride Month, this is something I care so deeply about. And um, when you read the book and you realize that the man on the cover, his name is Ted Burr. Um, he was 19 years old in 1943. Yeah. 1943. Mm -hmm. And it's funny, because my mom and I were just talking about this, too, because she was born in 1944. And to be um, confused about your gender in 1943 was a huge deal. Absolutely. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let Lenny talk about that a little bit. Um, because this, this is why we're wearing these t-shirts with Ted. Yes. Um, he has since passed, but we are... We are we we're are keeping his story, his legacy, his life. His story and actually alive. actually exactly. we're bringing his young story out in the open. Yes, this was not known no. by by even his contemporaries at that time. Exactly, he trusted me at that time to yes. tell me the story of his past and to do exactly. a book and to do a film. Yes. So that was this actually is, a big coming out for this him. This is huge. This is really huge. Not only was it. That he looked like this in 1943 and in a small town, but he had the courage to walk down the street to get his photograph taken just in case that he might get drafted into military service. He wanted to be commemorated looking like this. He did not want to look like his high school yearbook yeah. photo where he had to conform wearing a suit and tie. Mm -hmm. This is what he wanted to look like. And I, I believe he even posed this way because mm -hmm. he would um, have actress photos. Yeah, and it's his a beautiful photo. And his I favorite actresses study. posed in this pose. Yes, and I, yes, and that's I, a very 1940s and, look. Yeah, and I believe that he really um, knew that he wanted to be remembered this way. Yes, so that is why, I mean... Can I read the inscription? You absolutely can. Because this, absolutely. This, is, this tells you how special this... Absolutely. Young person was. Now, wonderful. he was 20 years old when he wrote this. You're going to love Lenny reading. Lenny's a, a very good reader. He wrote this in an autobiography <laughs> that he had sent to Henry Bellum. It got sent back with the letters, so it is published here in the book. But these words jumped out at me. Nevertheless, psychologists tell us that we are prone to remember the more pleasant aspects of life, and with these I do prefer to deal. Let the morbid and bloody real Wait to be bound in black leather when I am cold and still in eternity. Rather than I should like to cry, here I am when I was. And think not too bitterly on me. 
I tried. That's amazing. A twenty-year-old projects himself I know. deceased in That's the amazing. in the future and says, "I want the bloody real details of my life told That's and amazing. be bound in black leather." I have and to get a black a, leather version someday, yes. but yes, this, he predicted this. And that's what you did. And this is why Lenny has been working on this project. You want to talk about a passionate project? You've been working on this project for 23 years. Yes. 23 years. And I still have a future part and because yes. I've been working on a TV series based. Can you see this person as a lead in a TV series? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. It's, so it's amazing. It's, it's time. Yes. And it's really an important <clears throat> time. It, Bonnie, it's even I more know. important now because... People like this, unfortunately, in some areas, are being targeted as mm -hmm. not being like us. Exactly. Like not not one of us. Exactly. There are one. Everybody's one of, one of us. us. We're all, We're one, all of one of us. us. Exactly. We're all one, right? Yes, and, and to, and to, and to sing, single people that um, feel like their gender is in between and uh, that they're not one of us, yep. it's impossible. Every person who is born is born of a mother. Mm-hmm. And... Why would we treat any mother's child any exactly. differently? Exactly. It's all about love, inclusion, and even as Beth, Beth and Body Works, love always wins. I mean, <gasps> oh, you got it. <laughs> it's what it is. I mean, that sums it up. I mean, Ted, right. Ted, I honestly think that Ted, Ted would love this. Ted would be right here, right now. <laughs> he would be with us right now. <laughs> so um, he is. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm he gonna, is. He is. He okay. is. I'm gonna spray a little bit of sun, and then you're gonna tell everybody. Uh, we are in the Cleveland area, by the way, Lenny and I, right yeah. now. Um, and you have an upcoming presentation. He just did a presentation last night at Loganberry Books, if you know the area. And um, Dabama Theater is coming up. Yep. I'm going to spray a little of this on. That's where Ted <laughs> and I met at Dabama Theater. Look at this. Look at this. It's like it's foam. I love this stuff, by the way, you guys. This is the Golden Star Fruit Fresh Coconut Water and Cedarwood Heart. <gasps> yes. Isn't that cool? <laughs> <laughs> now you gotta go wash your hands off. Your hands are gonna be nice and soft. No, There's a shimmer. These are Ted's. <laughs> Ted, 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 Ted acted. He acted with his with the hands. He did. I wish you guys could have. He loved that. the 1940s I, actresses with the hands. Yes. Yeah, that's such a 1940s thing. It yes. really is. Yes, with the hands. I know. I know. So tell everybody about your Dabama thing. Okay, so um, at Dabama Theater on July 20th at seven o'clock, I'm going to be doing a presentation about. Uh, Ted Burr, Past, Present, and Future. Uh, the past, I'll show a 10-minute clip of the film, Letters to Uranus, that we saw the poster. Yep. Then I'm going to do selected readings from the book. Yep. We just, and then I perform a 10-minute scene. Oh, my gosh. Lenny is an amazing performer. From yes. the third episode of the proposed TV series. Absolutely. Absolutely fabulous. <laughs> Absolutely fabulous, darling. Absolutely fabulous. <laughs> so what we are going to do right now is we're going to produce this video, and then I am actually helping Lenny as we speak. We're doing real time here, you guys. Uh, I'm going to be sniffing a little cupcake. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Mm -hmm. <laughs> we're gonna light up a little cupcake candle we're gonna uh work on t-shirts and um i will be putting uh the link on my queen of the girl geeks uh facebook page if anyone is interested in the t-shirts for uh for june for pride month or any time we have a lot of versions we have a black and white version we have a colored version yeah. So, yeah, it's it's gonna be real classy. So that any any age, yes. any gender, any gender are going are yes. going to have something that they'll they'll appeal to. Them. Exactly. <laughs> so, oh my gosh, this was so much fun! I gotta bring Lenny again. back in the fall because we're gonna do Halloween. We gotta do Halloween absolutely. anyway. Have an absolutely fabulous Friday. <laughs> <laughs> we will see you guys later. Ciao. Bye.